Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley and this is Well Trying, the channel where I well try for well-being. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new here, hello. Thank you for coming. Today I wanted to make a video where I go to the thrift store and I try on Gameen lines because folks, after one year of searching, I think I've finally nailed it. I think that there's a strong possibility that I'm not a soft natural, but that I'm actually a gameen of some kind. Hear me out. So in my 20s, I used to wear a lot of more gameen type lines. I'm short, I have a short vertical, but I do have width. So it really made me reconsider being a gameen. When I first started my journey, I thought I was a gameen. And then I changed to soft natural because of the width aspect. I was watching a video recently by the channel Elisa. I think that's her name, Elisa. And she did a video on gameens and there was a, a photo in the video with someone with a body type very similar to mine. And I thought to myself, wow, that's me. So I've always kind of gravitated towards more shorter styles because I have a short vertical. I don't think I'm a dramatic classic because dramatic classic can pull off really long vertical lines and monochromatic looks. And I much, much, much prefer staccato color blocked. I've always been that way. I've always liked shorter shorts, um, short dresses, more, not like masculine, but more like sharp and tailored things as opposed to like cute and girly things. And I used to think I couldn't be a gamine because of my face type, but in that video, I saw that she had described gamines as having a more yin face and a more young body, but being petite. And that clicked. I never really enjoyed the soft natural clothing recommendations because I find that it's just too drapey. I always feel very sloppy in clothes like that whenever it's draped and loose and whatever. Uh, it just never really felt like me. So this is just an experiment after all. There's no um, hard and fast rules about it. And Kibby's not a science, it's just like some thought process that this guy who keeps changing it decided <laughs> in the 80s. So, you know, it's an evolution. Style is an evolution. People are evoluting. Evoluting? I am evoluting. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the thrift store. Enough of me ranting, enough of me talking. Let's just go and try on some clothes, see how they look. And if you're a soft natural who, think you, who thinks you could be a gamine, maybe this video will help. Or if you are just a person that likes watching people shop, Maybe you'll enjoy this video too. Who knows? Let's go. Okay, so the first outfit I tried on was this kind of red top with this frilly skirt, skirt thing. It's very feminine. I'm not very certain of it. It was a bit too long, so I tucked it in. I like how short it is. I like that it's like spunky and fun. I like that there's room for my chest and there's room for my arms and the sleeve length is good. I, I just feel like it's a little too, I don't know, a little too feminine or something for me. I'm just not feeling it, um, but I like the colors. So let's try something else. Okay, so this one is a shirt and I like the high neckline. I think that high necklines look nice on me, which makes me think, oh, I'm more gameen. Um, it's got an asymmetrical swoop around the chest area, which gives like room for my broadness. I ended up switching out the skirt because I just wasn't feeling it for the shorts that I wore. And I really, really like it. I think that it's just an interesting top. I think there's a lot of ways I can wear it that are more like flamboyant gameen or whatever, but it gives that kind of spitfire chic essence I'm looking for. And it was only 16 bucks, so I bought it. Okay, so this is a shirt from Zara and I really like it. It's got a pussycat bow, which goes well with soft natural and I think also soft gamine. It's got like animated details with the polka dots, the pink polka dots, and it's very like, I don't know, classy, I think. I think that it's fun because of the polka dots, but I also think that it's more like chic for a gaming style. I like the sleeves. I like the width accommodation. It's very comfortable to wear. It's not annoying. You know, sometimes you buy something at Zara and it's very um, just like precarious to wear. It doesn't tuck in, it folds, whatever. This felt really good to wear and it was only 20 bucks. So I felt very lucky to uh, have found it. I like the colors. I like how it fits with my shorts. Yeah, I just felt like this was an overall win. 
Okay, so this is my favorite outfit of the day. It's a short shift dress that's boxy and a little sheer at the bottom. I feel like this is a classic gamine line. It goes over my shoulders a little bit, like at the edges, so it kind of cuts them off, which I like. Um, it's a little sheer at the bottom, so I have to wear shorts, but I really like how short it is. I could picture Audrey Hepburn in something like this. I wore it to work last night and I was complimented a couple times. Someone actually said, you look well put together. So that was really nice. Um, I had some waist emphasis because I was wearing a belt, but I just like this silhouette and I think it looks harmonious with my body. You guys might disagree, but I I really enjoyed this and, and it was only $10 as well. So I'm really thankful to have found it because it's hard to buy dresses. Here's a couple looks that didn't work. This is a kind of dress that's just got no waist emphasis. It's really big. I think it was just a bit too big for me. Um, I always really like this style, but I just don't think it works for me. I like the color. I think the color is really nice. It's a little warm, but ultimately it just didn't work out. This is a high neckline white shirt, which I thought was a really interesting neckline to try. I've never worn a neckline like that. Um, I thought it was cute, but again, it just wasn't, it was a little too like loose. So my boobs kind of hung around a bit. <laughs> And uh, yeah, I just didn't end up really liking it or vibing with it that much. I like the color block, but not for me. And then this is the final dress I tried on. The colors aren't really for me. It's more of like an autumnal dress kind of, I think, or like a winter dress maybe. It didn't fit at all. It's from Urban Outfitters. I like the sleeves, but as you can see, my width is too much. <laughs> I like the, the shape and how short it is. I like that it's animated, but I think the prints are just a little bit too big or romantic or something for me. So ultimately it didn't work out.